Hello friends, in this video I am going to explain you how you can add multiple images in the pen.net and create the one final image out of that. So for that what you have to do is that you need to just drag and drop some of the images in here on the in the pen.net. So for that what you have to do is that you have to click on this just uh, go to the images that you want to add and then let us say you want to add this whatsapp image and youtube image and this this one as well then just select all the images that you want to add then just drag them on this pen.net and drop it and over here instead of clicking on opens each image you have to click on this add layers so what happens is that it loads the images and adds them as new layers in the current image so you can notice that uh, in the layers uh, window over here it is showing all the layers that have been added and now you can notice that uh, it is displaying this particular image over there that is youtube's image and then just after that there is whatsapp but uh, we can't see whatsapp because that whatsapp image is uh, hidden due to that youtube so what i'm gonna do is just i'm gonna move that image youtube image uh, over here on the right hand side for that we have to select that layer first of all and after selecting that layer what you can do is you can click on this tool called as move selected pixels and then just drag it like that so you can drag it like that and if you want to resize this you can resize whatever you want to resize whatever dimensions and you can see that whatsapp uh, is being displayed over here so first layer is this one and whatsapp image is the second layer so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna also just resize that whatsapp image so for that click on that whatsapp layer and then uh, to unselect this you, you can click on this button and now let us say you want to resize this so since we have already selected that layer all right so that is how you can do that uh, use this particular tool move selection to resize the images like this and you can also drop it like that now i'm gonna just uh, move this up side and just for deselect this and then the selection like that one now use this one to just drag it like that and we'll move it like this one And put it over there so that's how you can add multiple images and also if you want to change the background you can change the background as well so i'm going to just delete that image and let us say you want to add another background so there are two images over there so i'm just going to delete that and this one is also not required so right now you can see that there are three images at the top there is a youtube image then whatsapp and then finally this this image is there so if you want to move that image you can uh, just select it like that and move it around wherever you want so that is how you can uh, use these layers uh, to add multiple images and use these tools called as move selection and move selected pixels to um, like reposition the images or resize the images and then after you're done you can save this as uh, one image then for that you can click on save as and then instead of uh, saving this as a pdn file what you have to do is you have to select the jpg or the png so png selected generally if any you want to save this file as a just transparent background otherwise you can use jpg and uh, you can save it as a pdn pen.net file if you want to maintain those layers so that next time you can edit those layers so that is how you can work with multiple images in the pen.net